I was out of politics, folks, for 14 years. And then I started looking at what's going on in our country. I started looking at things are going to hurt the American dream, not enhance the American dream. I saw spending that is spiraling out of control all across our country. And I saw the same thing right here in the state of Arkansas. We simply can't afford to do what we're doing to our country. We have to get Tim Griffin elected this year. We have to get Bozeman elected this year. We have to get Beth Ann Rankin elected this year. Steve Womack, Rick Crawford, they understand how to say no. They understand how to bring fiscal responsibility back to our federal government. We're going to help them do that, aren't we? Yeah. Let me tell you what else we need to do. We need to look at the policies that are hurting our state at the federal level. We need to look at policies like Obamacare. How many of you all think Obamacare is a good idea? Raise your hand. I was going to say the Democratic headquarters are about two miles down on the left. And let me tell you why. Obamacare is not just bad public policy that got crammed down our throats. Obamacare is a job killer at a time that we simply can't afford to, to hurt our job market any further. You all agree with that? Yeah. Obamacare is expensive. It's going to cost our state $200 million that we don't have. You all agree with that? Yeah. But you know the worst part about Obamacare? It's a clear violation of our Tenth Amendment rights, and if we don't stand up for our Tenth Amendment, we're not going to stand up for our Second Amendment or the rest of our Constitution. We have to get with it this year. We have to stop that kind of thinking in this country. How many of you all think it's a good idea for any government, state government, federal, or local, to be able to tell you that you have to buy a specific product? Raise your hand. I didn't think so. If we lose this battle, it could be the end of federalism as we know it, folks. We simply can't let that happen. That's why I would have joined the suit to fight Obamacare, join 20 other states, send a clear message that we here in Arkansas understand how important that Tenth Amendment is and we're going to stand up for it. But our governor said we can't defy the federal government. We tried that back in 1957. It didn't work then and it won't work now. Well, folks, I disagree with our good governor. If we don't have the guts to stand up to the federal government when they are wrong, and say it is unconstitutional, we're going to stand up for those rights, we are just going to hand those rights over, we are not going to do that in the state of Arkansas. So the first day that I'm elected, we are going to join that lawsuit to fight Obamacare, I can assure you that. Now what's going on in our state, folks?